Welcome back, it's Last Call and it's cover week. We're here at Chalice Recording Studios in the heart of Hollywood where Lady Gaga recorded the Fame record. Later in the show, you'll see Weezer cover Gaga. But first, it's time for our Last Call Spotlight and tonight we feature a crazy person. You know, I'm terrified of heights. I've always lived my life by the motto, why jump out of a perfectly good airplane? Our guest tonight would argue, why limit it to a plane? This is Miles Dasher, Bass Jumper. Hi, I'm Miles Dasher. I'm with the Red Bull Air Force. I'm a professional bass jumper. For me, the most fun thing you can do is go base jumping. You're kind of freaking out internally, all your senses are kicking on, and all of a sudden you just push off of the earth. You're just like an astronaut for the first four seconds while the wind starts to pick up, and then you open up your parachute and you're really close to the ground. So it's kind of like uh, skydiving on steroids. You're not really allowed to go jump off of a lot of things. Like to go one of these buildings over here and just kind of like Because not a lot of people are gonna say, hey, come on out. Why don't you jump off our building with a parachute? Don't worry, nothing's gonna happen to you, right? I, in fact, moved to a place in Twin Falls, Idaho where they welcome base jumpers. I tried to jump everything that you can put on your roof rack of your car. Jumped a bicycle, jumped skis, jumped a kayak. Skyacking's really good for you. My favorite thing to do right now is wingsuit proximity stuff. When you're wingsuiting past big walls, you are flying. Your body becomes the wing. You just like look where you want to go and you're like, okay, I'm going there. Okay, I'm going there. You can fly these squirrel suits for about a minute to two minutes. Your inner animal is awake and alert and just tuned in and there's some points that stick out that you can really go and get some proximity flying on and, and give yourself a little bit of a scare. Squeeze those kidneys a little bit and get some juices flowing, you know, make you feel more alive than ever. You're getting that ground rush, and it's coming at you, coming at you, coming at you. And you're thinking, I'm gonna take this one low. I'm a base jumper, I'm crazy, I'm gonna go low, dirty low, and pull super dirty low. Your body has a natural, intuitive reaction to want to live. And your body will just do that, and you're like, oh, I could've waited another second. And then when you land, you think you're all calm, you're like, dude, that was sweet, that was the coolest time I ever had in my life. Everyone's heads is a million miles an hour. You know, the sport does have all kinds of risks to it. You're buzzing past all these walls at 120 miles an hour. If you touch one of them, it's over. You're like, game over, man. Thanks for coming. And it happened to, to my best friend, my, my partner, Shane McConkey. Dude, he's the original dude man, bro. The coolest guy I ever know on this whole planet. And uh, the most fun human being you could ever hang out with. And uh, whew, I can't believe we lost him, man. But I'll always cherish those moments that we had. You know, everyone says, well, you're insane for doing this, for having a family. And yeah, you might be right, but um, fear keeps you alive. If you're not afraid, man, you're, you're just kidding yourself. You shouldn't even be doing it. One of my biggest fears is, is leaving my family alone. I love to be able to share my experiences with them, but more so I love to just share their experiences with me. People say, no fear. And, uh, there's a lot of sense to that. Figure out what you're afraid of if you want to conquer it. And there he is, the flying squirrel. You could not pay me enough money to do that. Coming up, we've got Weezer at Live Nation's Hollywood Palladium giving us the first song of Cover Week. It's next.